So yeah, I guess we're going to be doing a Spears only playthrough as a team, so that's going to be interesting to see how the team copes with Spears, so yeah. And uh, yeah, this is our current setup, so we got a boxing glove, a plant, a star, and two Spear 1s uh, and two Spear 2s, so yeah. And uh, hmm, I think I'm going to have to work on that melee damage uh, when I get to that point. And maybe some more region would also be nice, and some more trees to spawn. That'd also be nice. There's a lot of things that I want in potato, but uh, I don't think any of them are going to be coming through uh, right now, so uh, yeah. Anyways, that's way for completed. And let's uh, toss the boiling water in the uh, recycle bin. Take some more melee damage. And take the coupon and the spear too. And save the star uh, for later. And let's also save that spear for later. So uh, yeah. On to A5. Welcome to A5. And uh, I think it's just business as usual, so that's uh, nice. I think I might have to combine those two spears. Uh, make a spear too, just to help increase the damage a bit. Hmm. And that's A5 completed with three crates. Uh, I guess like, we can take the last stud for more luck. Recycle the snake. Take the coupon. And take some more harvesting and some more melee damage because that's what I want right now. And take the spear, the star, and the alien ton. Save the butterfly for later along with whatever this thing is. I still don't know what that word is, so uh, yeah. On to A6. I think it's Ripple CD. Oh well. I'm just gonna end up butchering it every time I say it, so yeah. But hey, so far it's just business as usual, so that's good. Although I think I might want some more speed. Because speed is king. And as I said, it's completed. Let's take the baby ghetto because, uh, yeah. And let's take the region, which is now at 7, aka 0.73 HP per second. And let's take some more harvesting, which is now at 29. Take the butterfly and whatever this thing is. And take the plant. Hmm, nothing here. Take the dangerous bunny. Save the tractor for later. And save the tentacle for later. And I think it's time to move on to A7, so uh, yeah. Welcome to A7. AKA business as usual so far, so that's good. And if you're wondering how well I'm holding up, well, this should uh, give you the answer to that. So apparently we're doing pretty well at this stage of the game. So hopefully it uh, stays that way uh, throughout the rest of this game, so yeah. Anyways, that's why it's haven't completed. Let's recycle the gambling token. And take some more harvesting. And take the tractor, the tentacle. And a wheelbarrow, because that's more harvesting, which is now at 97, so that's good. Hmm... I don't think I want that white flag. So, uh, let's just say the tentacle, and move on to wave 8, so, uh, yeah. Welcome to wave 8. I gave that, that wave before the Speedy Boys wave, and it's just business as usual. Even with these, those guys, uh, whatever they were. The ones with the large pulls of health at this stage of the game are, uh, getting deleted, so that's good. Ow. So, yeah, hopefully I can survive the, uh, next, uh, 22 seconds, so I can get a, uh, run, well, wave completed screen, so that'd be nice. Ow. And so far, we seem to be healing up pretty well, so that's good. And that's, uh, wave 8 completed. Let's use that with the incendiary turret, and I have 102 harvesting now. So let's take some more regen, because that's what I need. And take some more speed, because speed is king. And let's take the tentacle. And the silver bullet. Hmm. Take the spear. And save the scared sausage for later. And let's just move on to that speedy boys wave, so uh, yeah. Welcome to the speedy boys wave. Okay, that one wave with a lot of things that pop really easily, so that's nice. And that's wave 9 completed. Let's recycle the strange book. 
And take some more armor. Take the speed, because speed is gain. Take the scared sausage, the vigilante ring, and take the spear three. Hmm, nothing here that I want. Take the bean teacher. And say the uh, spear two and the mastery for later. And let's uh, move on to wave 10 after we take the charcoal because that's a uh, more elemental damage and melee damage. Both of which are things that we want. Now I'm broke. And welcome to wave 10. Or I hope I can fix that issue being broke. So yeah. And so far it's just business as usual. So that's good. And I think I see uh, threats for 100 whenever they do uh, fire off. Yeah, I think we might have to work on that uh, scared sausage a bit this uh, run. Hmm. And there's the first crate of this wave, so that's good. And that's uh, wave 10 completed. Let's take the campfire for more region and elemental damage. And let's take some more speed, because speed is keen. And take the harvesting, because that's also keen. Or would it be a prince? Oh well. I think you can debate that in the comments below. So let's take the spear 2 and stop worrying about that. And take the mastery. And take the Cyclops Worm for more damage. And take the Bean Teacher for more XP. And let's just move on to wave 11. So uh, yeah, it's nice that we found the uh, Vigilante Ring at uh, this stage of the game. So welcome to wave 11. AKA business as usual. Because uh, these things get deleted uh, whenever they all focus on uh, an enemy. So that's good. And that's wave 11 completed. Let's see the adrenaline because that's plus 5 dodge and 50% chance to heal 5 HP when dodging an attack, which is uh, rather good. So let's take some armor. Take some more max HP because that's what I think I need. And let's see the recycling machine. And let's see the bean teacher again because the game seems to love giving me those. I guess it wants me to do really well on the XP department, so that's nice. Hmm, nothing here. Normally I take a lot of stuff, but I brought a scared sausage that I want to boost, so uh, yeah, that minus one elemental damage is a bit of a deal breaker. Hmm, nothing here. Save the Spear 3 for later. Take the Medical Turret. And save the Lure for later as well, because that's two additional uh, walking crates. So, yeah. On to 812. So. Welcome to 812. AKA business as usual. Now at the Medical Turret. So, that's nice. And somehow I keep running into enemies, but oh well. At least I can heal up pretty quickly from that. So, that's good. And that's 812 completed. Let's get some lifesteal, funnily. Actually, you know what? Let's actually get some more damage. And some more elemental damage. For the scared sausage. And let's take the spear three, like so. Take the lure. Uh, nothing here. Take the star. And nothing here. And save the improved tools for later. And I think it's time to move on to A13. So yeah, welcome to A13. AKA business as usual, so that's good. Hmm. I think I might want some more elemental damage. Oh well. I can worry about that when I get there, so yeah. And I think that's one of the loot uh, crate aliens. Alright, rather the walking crates, and now uh, it's the Viking helmet uh, guy. And they all seem to die pretty quickly. So that's good. For us anyways. Not necessarily them. And that's a 13 completed. Let's see the book. And the head injury because that's more damage. Which is always a good thing. And let's see the mass HP. Take the lock. Which uh, brings us up to 80. And the harvesting is 145. So that's uh, nice. So let's take the improved tools. Take the spear two and the bean teacher. And save the spear three for later. And let's just move on to A14. So uh, yeah. Hmm. 
And welcome to A14, aka business as usual, so that's good. And if you're wondering how well I'm doing right now, well, uh, I think I should demonstrate uh, that. So yeah, we're doing pretty well so far. And hopefully it stays that way throughout the rest of this run. Ow. Oh well, at least it, we can heal up pretty quickly. So yeah, that's good. And we should be completed wave 14 in 3, 2, 1, and wave 14 completed. Let's get the headshot into the recycle bin. And take the charcoal for more elemental and melee damage. And take some, take some more speed because speed is king. And let's take some more uh, uh, dodge because why not. And take the spear 3 by recycling the spear 2. Nothing here. Take the clover for more luck and dodge. Which is now at 100% more luck. And dodge is not 17%, so that's good. Actually, let's take the target grade first and save the spear 3 for later. And move on to A15. AKA, the 5 ways left until the boss. Uh, so, yeah. Welcome to A15. AKA, business as usual, so that's good. And if you're wondering how well we're doing, well, I think this should be a good demonstration because we're hitting 162 uh, crits, so that's good. And I think uh, 162 is enough uh, damage to delete anything in this king's path. And that's for when he gets hit by the enemies from behind. And that's not good. And uh, yeah, if you're wondering how well we're doing, well, this should uh, serve as a demonstration because it's 3, 2, 1, and that's way 15 completed. And I'm sad that I didn't get the, uh, walking crate. So, let's take the baby gecko because that's a plus 20% uh, chance to instantly attract the material when it's dropped, and that's pretty good. Let's take some more melee damage. Which just added, like, plus 8, I think. And it's now at 30, so that's a heck of a lot of damage. Let's take some more armor. And take the spear 3. And the Cyclops Worm. And nothing here. Take the tractor from our uh, armor scene. And nothing here. Oh wait, there's a baby Jetro, so let's take that. And now I'm broke. And let's move on to A16. So, uh, yeah. Welcome to A16. AKA that way where everything in my path gets deleted. So that's good. Then I'm at, at least uh, I'm at that stage of the game. And there's a 226. And I think that's from the tier 4 uh, spear, so yeah. I got a heck of a lot of damage going out at the enemies, and that's a good thing for me. And with that, that is, uh, wave 16 completed. And we did a bandana. Ironically, that's uh, pretty good when we're uh, using something like SMGs or shotguns, but uh, not this time around, so let's just refactor that. Let's take some more regen, and that puts us up to 2.07 HP per second. And let's take some more elemental damage for the scared sausage, which is not 9. Nothing here. And I think we can take the lucky charm, even though that's gonna take uh, 2 melee damage away from us. But I had 30 more luck. And take the toss of sludge. And uh, let's not take the bloody hand. And let's see the uh, sunglasses for more crit chance and the bowler hat for more luck and harvesting. Actually, never mind uh, the attack speed and the crit chance debuffs are a bit of a deal breaker. So let's take the alloy instead. And it's time to move on to a 17 because I'm now broke. But at least I have 209 harvesting, so that uh, should come in handy. And uh, yeah, I think we're at the stage where the mu musical notes guys are getting deleted. And one volume, so that's good. Even when they're upgraded, they still get deleted. And uh, yeah, if you're wondering how well I'm holding up right now, well, uh, this should be a good demonstration, because seriously, look at that damage uh, output. I think I created a right monster with this build right now, so that's good. And that's way 17 completed. Let's take the uh, wheelbarrow, and recycle the glasses, take the bag, and whatever this thing is. And let's take some more luck. And nothing here. 
nothing here. Take the, the diploma and the bean teacher and the coupon. And now I'm broke and there's nothing here. So let's just move on to wave 18. AKA the next to last wave before the final boss. And if you're wondering how well I'm holding up, well, there should be a good demonstration of how well I'm holding up. So yeah, pretty well. And with that, wave 18 should be completed in two, one, and that's wave 18 completed with three traits. Let's just start with the padding. And we start with the wings. And the other pair of wings. Oh, that stream loves giving me wings. And apparently it loves giving me regen. So let's take that. That's now up to 27, aka 2.51 HP per second. And let's take some more. Hmm, that's HP actually. Let's take a bad. And you can't fire for more regen. And that's now at uh, 2.69 HP per second. And then here, uh, the last two digits of that number is a uh, lucky number, so hopefully that should be a good indicator for us. And nothing here. Oh wait, there's a little muscly dude, so let's take that one for more melee damage. And take the Sawtrap Swarm. And I completely missed uh, one of those uh, energy bracelets, didn't I? Oh well. Nothing here. Nothing here. Let's take the second medical turret. And now I'm broke. On to wave 19. So, uh, yeah. Welcome to the last wave before the final boss. Okay, that wave where harvesting becomes uh, irrelevant if you're not doing in endless mode, which you're not uh, doing in an endless mode run. So, yeah. But hey, at least everything gets deleted uh, whenever they walk into the range of my spear. So, that's good. And I just have to be careful about uh, not walking into any enemies like that. But hey, at least our medical turrets can keep up with the damage. So that's good. And if you're wondering how well I'm doing, well, this should be a good demonstration of how well I'm doing. And with that, that is uh, wave 19 completed, like so. And let's take the SO skeleton for more armor. Uh, ditch the wings in the bin. Take some more melee damage. And some more elemental damage. And take the diploma for more XP gain and engineering. Although the engineering stat is the only relevant stat of the diploma right now. And it's uh take the spear three because I normally have lights the grinds magical lead to show up a bit earlier. I'd say near the beginning of the wave, but well it didn't. So let's take the cyclops arm for more damage, which is now at 123. And let's take the blindfold. And take the plant, because now that's a uh, 30 uh, regeneration per second, aka 2.76 HP per second. And let's take the beanie for more speed. And now I'm really broke, so I guess on to the final boss. So yeah, and I think this is our final build uh, for now. So, and by for now, I mean for the uh, run. So let's hope we can uh, deal with the boss pretty quickly. And seriously, look at that health bar disappear. And I think that's uh, the first mutation. And now it's shooting on the bullets at me, so let's just dodge them all. And I think the boss is almost dead. And now the boss is dead at 69 seconds. So yeah, I guess that was how well the team uh, works with the spears, which is apparently pretty well. So uh, yeah, I guess I'll see you in the next one uh, tomorrow, so stay tuned for that one. Bye.